We're gonna be meeting up with Matt, uh, Matt Hill, and uh, Tom. Tom is Tom is uh, catching up. Okay. Uh, objective today: do a little bit of uh, maybe some mileage, some time trials, and then uh, from there we're gonna come back here and uh, do a quick jogging. So we always have uh, our sessions here at um, at Mimosa, so you can join us here anytime you want anytime uh, Hills uh, I mean Matt's uh, driving all the way from from Manila so we'll see you in a moment good morning Tom will catch up he'll bought a brand new saddle and we're gonna adjust it today and then test ride it with a three-hour bike ride he's never ridden this before so it's gonna be a good test okay ready 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 so nobody's here except Tom Hill and Matt again. <laughs> How come nobody shows up except uh, Hill? Okay. So this is our. Uh, we have to go out of Mabalakat Gate. Same. Okay. So we're just gonna do. Uh, objective would be uh, an 80 kilometer ride around around town. Okay. Here we go. Uh, so we're back here at our headquarters at Quest. Uh, met some of the boys who are doing Ironman and then uh, from here we're gonna be uh, doing a few laps So that's quest Okay, so we're gonna go now. We'll see you in a moment We're gonna do a really quick ride meet up with Papa Louie and Aeros and everyone else at uh, New Clark City and off we go so we're gonna do a little bit of a warm-up hill here uh, hails from Davao he uh, used to join a few Ironmans and then in front of Hill is Matt Matt total brand new newbie for triathlon and duathlon but he figured maybe it's the right time to join and then leading us will be Tom Tom will be uh, guiding everyone through traffic because we need to exit Clark um, it's just amazing how Clark is right now. They really promote cycling. And you can see here from the tree lined uh, highways going through properly marked uh, road signs. It's the next best thing to a well planned community. And uh, Clark is uh, positioning itself to be one of the, you can say, modern cities in the philippines with provisions for bike lanes uh, a train station that hopefully can carry bikes uh, that will save a lot of time for most people we head out as early as 5 15 a.m just to make sure that uh, we don't get uh, bogged down by traffic when we go out of clark and that's the international airport that's uh, going to be the brand new international airport we're just going and exiting Clark at the moment through the Mabalakat Gate and uh, pass through the National Highway. This new road section is, you can say, amazing. Uh, I can say it's international standard. Just so because uh, everything is well marked, the uh, road signs are properly placed. You can get confused. And as we go along, we just want to make sure that uh, we stay on a super straight line, not bunch up because there are a lot of people going to and from work um, if you are a cyclist we have to be mindful we're leaving uh, Clark now so we're gonna go out to uh, Kapas Tarlac and meet some of the locals from Kapas after passing through the national highway we now enter Kapas this is where the bulk of the workout is gonna happen we just need to choose a really clear set of roads keep on going if you want to go to the CR, you're going to get left behind, huh? Go, go, go! You have to pee on your shorts. This is hardcore training, okay? Of course, I'm just joking. That's not true. We are never hardcore. We just want to go through carless, fresh air, nice roads, nobody uh, to shout at because that's not going to be fun. Um, and maybe meet more 
cyclists around the road and uh, make new friends. Just to remember, whenever, if ever, you see us riding along the road, feel free to uh, tag along. It's always fun to have more people around. So we start pushing the pace, and this is Hill's first time to stay on his air bar for three hours. Hopefully, he's gonna survive it. We're still fixing his posture on this particular time trial bike because this time trial bike is a little bit too long for him, obviously, uh, as you can see from the photos and the videos. Uh, but um, this is part of his learning program because he already has the bike, so he might as well uh, train okay. for it. Yeah, no problem. Good, good, good. Everyone okay? So one last lap, huh? Last lap. That was quick so that was almost 80 kilometers of riding uh with hill on this aero bar and everyone else not stopping stopping is prohibited on this particular day <laughs> just to simulate an actual race day so we're now heading back home the calm before after the storm and this is what you get really nice highways relaxing day overcast nothing can be perfect remember it's always nice to stay healthy right now after the pandemic after the lockdown You'll never go wrong living an active life. Okay, so we just finished our uh, 82K time trial. Oh, here we go. Thank you. Okay, so we're done uh, doing our natural nutrition. Uh, so we suggest to make your uh, sporting career sustainable, stay natural. So you stay young. So this is what you call breakfast of champions. I'm so proud of you. You finished it. You finished it. I'm so proud of you, man. I mean, te tears of joy, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Dragon fruit. What? I didn't know that I could finish the three loops. You didn't know that you're gonna finish the three loops? <laughs> and he finished the three loops, right? You did super well, huh? Very nice. But you're okay. You're happy that we did this, right? Okay, very nice. Bukajus time. We finished everything. It's uh, Hill's first time to ride his time trial bike for uh, three hours straight, like three hours straight. And every after workout, don't drink energy drinks. Get something more natural. Okay. So and uh, drink this. You'll never go wrong. Okay, see you in a moment, dude. We still have to go home. Not a happy camper, huh? <laughs> Not a happy camper. Busy too. Not a happy camper. <laughs> yeah, we still have to go home. Yeah, yeah. Uh, how many Ks? 100K. 100 K. Okay. Are you happy 100K more? No? Okay. 100K more, dude. 100K. Okay? What? Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. Let's go. There you go. So, this is a sweat van. Uh, you use this for uh, sweat and then we are going to use our arrow, arrow, arrow helmet. This arrow helmet really, really helps out <clears throat> and it makes you a little bit faster. There you go. It's uh, made by Ecoy. Now there's this weird lock. Oh, okay. There you go. Okay. Go home, go.
Thank you, Ate. So we're gonna go home now. Uh... Okay, boys, let's go. On to the highway. Back to Clark. So that was not 100k, I was just joking, but as soon as we arrived at Quest Hotel, uh, we met some really cool guys, super nice uh, boys from Bataan. They rode all the way to Bataan for the race for tomorrow. Nice workout, boys. <laughs> so we're finally done with Matt being very happy, super happy. You're more than happy? Yeah. <laughs> Even after you did 80 kilometers? <laughs> Are you sure you're happy? I don't like it anymore. <laughs> you don't like it anymore. Malungkot, no? Nalaspag. Bakit bakit niya ganyan si Papa Luwi, di ba? Si Papa Luwi lagi nga Yung dapat uh, yung love life mo dapat yeah. lagi masaya. Importante yun eh kasi uh, yun ang uh, isa sa mga nagbo ng ano mo yun eh. Exactly. Yung para bang gusto mo lagi maganda ka tuwan no kapag maganda life love life. Perfect. Di ba? Perfect. Yes, di ba? Are you sure? <laughs> Why you sad? Coach. Coach. <laughs> <laughs> ako hindi ko naniniwala ang laspag. Ako hindi ako naniniwala. Si Tommy never ko siyang nakita ng laspag kasi nakasama kasama ko sa mga sa mga lakas. So naniniwala ako ano, no? Love life coach. Okay. <laughs> my what? You're right. Oh, my right. It was um yeah. Is 82 kilometers okay? 82. Awesome. Hard, fast, fun. Sure. You had fun. 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 You sure you had fun? Fun. <laughs> <laughs> So, uh, having fun here with the bike and look at him, super tired. <laughs> what a cry, baby. The rain coming down right now? Yeah. A cold water bath really, really helps the uh, sore muscles. It acts like an anti-inflammatory. Remember when you get bruises, you put uh, ice on them to stop the bleeding or micro bleeding it's the same thing here it's always a good uh, idea to have a cold bath after a very long day and uh, the boys and i just had to do a little bit of uh, laps before we uh, go ahead and uh, finish it so three kilometers of swimming not bad all good we were just about to swim and nobody was here like totally empty pool where where are you so we're just gonna swim right now it's supposed to be fun We'll get, we're gonna make it fun and let's find out after the session how everyone feels, okay? So sometimes we just gotta swim because uh, they said there was no program and nobody comes in and then Tom comes in. Sure. Swimming. How do you feel swimming now? Uh, I feel amazing. I am so glad that You're I not came. lying. I'm not lying. <laughs> I'm being dirty. <laughs> I'm not lying. It's really fun. <laughs> It's really fun. You gotta do this, man. You gotta do it. Okay, gotta... so you heard it from the tag. Join it's... CRG oh, yeah. Swimming, right? Super fun, super fun. Okay, okay. <laughs> you heard it straight from the mouth of Tom. Join the CRZ Swimming program and you're gonna be... Ha you're... You're gonna be... <clears throat> well, yeah, you're gonna... Yeah, well, anyway, that's a different story altogether, but yeah. <laughs>